Okay, problem 13. The figure shows a siphon discharging oil of specific gravity 0.9. The siphon is composed of 75 mm diameter pipe from A to B followed by 100 mm diameter pipe from B to D open discharge at C. The head losses are from 1 to 2.35 meter, from 2 to 3.21 meter, from 3 to 4.75 meter. Compute the following, the discharge in liters per second, the pressure at 2, the pressure at 0.3. So this is the given figure. So first we write energy equation between 0.1 on the surface and 4 which is open to the atmosphere and we select the datum through elevation 4 so that through 4 so that the elevation there is 0 so velocity head at 1 pressure head at 1 elevation head at 1 equals velocity head at 4 pressure head at 4 elevation head at 4 plus head loss from 1 to 4 so velocity head at 1 is 0, pressure head is 0, exposed to the atmosphere, elevation head 3 equals unknown, velocity head at 4 unknown, pressure head at 4 0, elevation head 0, then head loss quantity 0 0.35 plus 0 0.21 plus 0 0.75. So from here we can solve velocity head at 4 which is also equal to the velocity head at 3 because we have the same diameter. So velocity head at 4 equals velocity head at 3 equals 1.69. So from there, we can solve the velocity at 4 or 3, 5.758 meters per second. So the discharge therefore is pi over 4. The diameter is 100 mm or 0.1 meter. Pi over 4 times 0.1 squared times 5.758 times 1000. So the discharge is 45.22 liters per second. For the pressure at 2, we write energy equation between 1 and 0.2. And this time, still the datum through elevation 4 or at elevation 0. So velocity head at 1, 0. Pressure head 0, elevation head 3 equals velocity head at 2, which is to be computed. Pressure head P2 over 0 0.9 times 9.81. Elevation head 4.5 plus head loss between 1 and 2, 0 0.35. So let's solve for velocity at 0 0.2. Diameter is 75 mm. 75 mm or 75 square times V2 equals 100 square times 5.758 we do not consider pi over 4 anyway it will be cancelled so v sub 2 is 10.24 meters per second then square this value divided by 2g which is 19.62 the velocity head at 2 is 5.341 and substitute here so 0 plus 0 plus 3 equals 5.341 plus v2 over 0.9 times 9.21 plus 4.5 plus 0.35 so from there, we can compute the pressure at point 2 equal to negative 63.49 kilopascals. Then for the pressure at 3, we write energy equation between 3 and 4. You can also write 1 to 2 or 2 to 3, but for convenience, 3 to 4. So we have velocity head at 3, which is 1.69. Pressure head unknown, P. 3 over 0 0.9 times 9.1 elevation head 4.5 equals velocity head at 4 also 1.69 pressure head 0 elevation at 0 head loss from 3 to 4 is 0 0.75 so solving for p3 p3 is negative 33.1 kilopascals